Let me start off by asking you, how do you feel tonight's game will go? Well, we've had a good week in practice this week. Um, 3 0, we're looking to make it 4 0. That's the main goal, and I think we're focused. Now, Grant, you've had a phenomenal three games with a total of 504 yards, four touchdowns, one interception. You've led your, and you've obviously led your team to three wins. Obviously, you're looking for number four. But how do you feel? personally going into this game well like I said we had a good week in practice on offense so I mean I got some good wide receivers the lines got it together this is a big matchup for us it's our first district game looking at a good game of course but like how do you think you will do how many yards do you think you'll be getting how many touchdowns do you want to get you know all that good stuff I or do you or, or do you just want it to just kind of happen to you I don't make predictions I'm just looking for a I like that attitude. Wharton, they have a great cornerback. Offers from almost everywhere. He's a 2019 cornerback. His name's John Dixon. How are you going to handle this? Well, with a cornerback like that, you always have to know where he's at on the field, of course. But uh, I'm not afraid to throw to him. I mean, I'm, but I'm going to be aware of where he's at. Now, Grant, you're standing in at six foot, 165 pounds. That's pretty good size for a junior high school quarterback. How big a factor does your size play into effect when you're behind the offensive line? Well, you know, I, I go against D linemen that are way bigger than me, so I mean, it's just really, my line does a good job of protecting me. Do you have any aspirations to play college ball? Yes. Uh, are you looking at any specific colleges? I mean, uh, I think I want to play in-state, but uh, I mean, I'm just going to go to whatever college, you know, shows the most interest in me. That's good. Now. Grant, you've went from JV quarterback freshman year. Then, in your sophomore year, you finally made it to varsity. You were the backup quarterback behind Chris Fadul. Now, you've worked your way up to starting quarterback. On an emotional scale, how does being the starting quarterback feel for you? I mean, it's a, it's a good feeling to progress like that, but the goal is not to start, it's to succeed at my position on the varsity level because just starting is not good. Thank you, Grant. Great asking you questions. Hope you ball out tonight. Thank you, sir. How do you feel personally going into this game? Well, it's just like any other game, Jeremy. You, know, you got to take it one, one game at a time. You got to take it one play at a time. I think our guys are prepared. You know, Hurricane Irma kind of came through and did some damage to, to our schedule of things, but uh, we're excited. You know, you can't get 5-0 until you're 4-0. So our guys believe it. They believe the locker room believes it. They believe that when they step on the field, they're going to win. So we believe it in here as well. Coach, you have a phenomenal quarterback, Grant Sessoms. How important has Grant been to the team? Well, everything rolls around the quarterback. And... If you, if you know or understand football, if you got a guy that can wheel and deal with the ball in his hands, you got an opportunity to win football games. And Grant has, has grown over the past couple years, and he has an adequate understanding of the offense, and he does some good things. There's some things that he needs to improve on, which all always our guys room, do. Yeah, always room for improvement. Yep, 
and uh, but he's the type of kid that's always going to be competitive, and you know we're going to go into a dark alley. He he's coming in with me because I know him and a few others that are going to do it. So, but with him playing at quarterback, I mean he's done some great things. Five hundred four yards passing already. Um, and he just four touchdowns, one interception. Yep, four touchdowns, one interception. So uh, we're lucky to have him. You know, he's yeah. a great young man, and uh, he'll to continue to grow. What is the overall goal for the 2017 football season? We want to go as far as we can. We want to get an opportunity to play for another district title, and get one, and go as far as the playoffs. A lot of kids want to play for a state title. You know that that's an opportunity, but. You have to be good every day. You have to be precision every day for that to happen. And you got to have a little lady luck on your side. But if, if, if our guys are willing to work and put in the hours and put in the time, life becomes really good. It'll be fun. Mm-hmm. Well, Coach, I want to say thank you. Uh, that's all we have uh, for today. Um, have a great day.